Um, I have a little, sorry, I'm taking it. So, um, I'm doing my favorite product of the year, um, which that really doesn't happen with me a lot because I don't have as much products as I really need to. Um, I actually have two. Um, so, yeah. Um, my very first product. I have more than one of them of the year is um, the 3D white um, command strips. Um, it's just my favorite. They're my favorite. I have a few more left because they are a lot of money. They're like 20 bucks for a whole package, but a lot comes in them. So yeah, this is one of the products of the year. Another product of the year is I don't have any more of this. This is my very, this is my very last. This is all the stuff I have left of my um, Paul Mitchell stuff that makes your hair really nice and soft, and it looks like goop. Literally, it just it just so gross. But like when you put it on your hand, it's all oily. But it like it feels so oily and it's just like blue. It's blue, um, and it smells really good. It smells. I can't describe that smell. So it's blue and it just softens up your hair. It's like goop. So go ahead and go buy these. These really help my teeth and my hair. Um, also, uh, I like to use. Um, a lot of other stuff on my hair, but this is the only stuff that I will use. Um, like, uh, some people, they don't buy this stuff because they think it doesn't really work, but it really works for me. See, it's just blue. Here, let me put some on my finger. It just looks so gross because, look, it looks like... Ew. So I'm just going to, like, get my hand in there. It's like all oily and stuff. Put my hair, like, your hair is supposed to be wet for you to put this on your hair, but it doesn't really matter. When you take it out, it's kind of white. But, you know. My mom, she used to always put this in my hair, and I'm like, ew, mom, what is that? Because I never liked the smell of it, and then now I love the smell of it. It's so yummy. Like, they never changed the smell, so. Um, that's when I was like, seven I think um and I'm not 14 now but um I changed a lot so yeah this is really cool and if you're wondering why it's in a baggie I do not have any I lost like I didn't lo lose the drawer but I did um like a little project and I had to have like a can like that and like a little thing like that and I just took that um try to see if you can see my face can you guess what I'm doing try to guess comment down below you might get a free you might get this free product of stuff it's gross but trust me it helps your hair so much I love it so yeah now, um, for some fun products of the year, you're going to think this is cool. Let me get... Sorry, there's so much noise, I'm so sorry. I think this is one of the coolest toys I've ever had. Um, literally, I love it. I love it. It's, it's called a crayon maker. 
Um, first of all, um, it's like really cool. Um, So this is really cool. It just like it's a crayon maker set. Um, so it's just like that. Um, let me get the thing that's supposed to go in here. So, you know, call me crazy, or is this awesome? I make my own crayons. Like literally, I give um, people like these really cool crayons for um, Valentine's Day at school because, you know, I can't. Um, Sorry, I made a big mess. I'll get those later. But it's just so cool because you can make your own color of crayons. Here's a few of them that I have made in my past little bit. It gives you a really good amount. It gives you at least four crayons. But I let my sister have another one. So I'm just going to show you what it should look like. It's awesome. Um, So yeah, like they're good for gifts. If like you put them in a little bag, you give them some crayons. If they really like crayons, um, some of my friends ask, like, because I brought some crayons to school that are like, So. Yeah, it just like makes a really cute color. Like when you write, it changes colors up so much. Um, my favorite one lately, um, I call this one the uh, the great swirl. This one the tie dyed swirl. Um, this one the crazy swirl. This one has like a red, pinkish, greenish, light greenish, everything like, like it's awesome. Um, so here's the little machine. So you put,
then you put this in here. So see, it's, uh, it just like fits in here. And you undo it and then, yeah. So you put your cans, just for instance, let's take these ones. And I put them in there. Gonna put one in there. And then you turn this one on so, um, you turn this on when it's plugged in and then it makes it hot. Um, and then this little thingy, it dumps all the wax that's been melted down into this, these little holes, like you probably can't see them, and it dumps them down into there, and it forms into the crayons, it forms the crayons into like this, it forms it into a crayon. So I think this is so cool. I got this for um, Christmas. I do not know um, where else you can get this. I got this one at Walmart, I think, or something like where right there. Um, this will be locked for a very long time. Well, not too long because it like takes it takes um, 15 minutes to make these crayons, or for you to make your crayons. So yeah. I love to make them. They're so easy and fun, and they're barely even a mess. Just it depends on when you're doing it, uh, where you're doing it, and what you're doing it with, or like if this, if these aren't screwed on, really good. Yeah. So it gets really hot with the light in there and all that. I've done like uh, I've never done a video for this because it's been at my dad's house. Um, my dad moved to North Dakota. Blessing. Um, if you try to open it, it's gonna like, never open. Well, open because um, it's not like really uh, really uh, plugged in. If it was plugged in, it would totally um be working and it'd be like locked down, so it wouldn't, so you wouldn't be able to open it like that. So yeah, I just like to put all these crayons in there but um I do try to find a paper for these so yeah um let me get my notebook and I'll show you what it writes like well just let me show you what it writes like One So, let's do it on this page and I'm going to write my name on it. So this is going to look kind of weird. Um, here. So here, um, this is what it looks like when you're like, coloring it like that see how it's like blue up here and then like green and purple and it just makes a really cute color um i think you could like name these and then like um make it look cool and like make sure like you can make like you can actually make your own crayons like your favorite colors so like if you don't like want like to find a bunch of crayon colors like oh I need to find a blue one I need to find a green one I need to find a purple one here you go you have your own crayon and you start writing um this one wrote differently because I had like different colors so yeah, this bottom one, it has like, um, Lee's letter has, Lee's letters, the A and the, no, the D and the A, um, have different colors. Oh my gosh, guys, I hope you will go back 
out and buy this. Um, Cause you know, I don't want to be like a boring person when I'm in school. Like, oh my gosh, I want everybody to be like, oh my gosh, you have the, you have those. I'm like, these aren't even out. Like these, these like haven't even been invented yet. And they're like, well, yeah, you just barely invented them. I'm like, no, I didn't invent them. Because I made them. I made them. Um, I actually, like, don't just do, like, stickies, like, sticks. I like to do other colors, like, um, like, not, like, sticks. I like to do hearts. I like to do, um, squares. I like to do all that. Um, so, yeah. Um, it's really cool. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Bye.